everyone. Friends, we are again. Another bon appetit. This issue is fresh off the presses and it is best new restaurants. Entrees. And I have this is the October 2022 issue. This is a paint. show you kind of like the color shape here. It, it's like a little beauty blender. It's like a little silicone little knob. I use it to make mix paint and um, add in things into paintings for or clay. You can use this for clay as well. Anyway, it's nice. It's got a nice little thing to it. So I can the pages with it, I think. And I have nubs for nails still, so let's just not talk about it this time. We won't pay attention. We'll pay attention to all the goodies in the book. Yes. All right. Let's get into this. Oh, and I also have a brisk iced tea. Just drinking it right out of the can. It's highly unusual for me, but you see, it is cold. So, anyway, I was just dying of thirst, and I just grabbed it and started drinking it. And then I didn't put it on the cup with ice, which is very rude for me, if you know me. Anyway, <laughs> TMI for no apparent reason. All right, so you might hear me taking a... So here it is. A little advertisement. And this is the table of contents. And here's another advertisement for a delectable ice cream bar. This is double caramel. Do you say caramel or Caramel. I say caramel. Caramel. No, I say caramel. It's the Magnum ice cream. Another advertisement for a vehicle. And the return of ABA's best new restaurant. What is this? Oh, this looks like a pecan roll. What is it? One of the best breakfasts in America. Oh. Here is an advertisement for some little crackers and cheese and salami. Um, a Las Vegas MGM uh, advertisement. Las Vegas Strip. I'm not amused with Vegas. I never have been. I never will. So what is this? Family meal. Looks like there's some pot stickers. These are good to have on hand. Charleston, South Carolina. Looks like some purple mashed potato and pickle and potato salad. I don't know what this is. I guess we're going to find out. Pork chops with frisee apple salad. Latin. Um, sorry. I gotta read this book. Malaysian style chicken and rice salad. Mm. 
Rose and Greens Chili Butter. Shrimp Pasta with Preserved Lemon. London Pouring. A natural wine soaked tour of Britain's capital with nary a pint in sight. True to food. These are all the little tidbits of foods they're showing you. It's like a nice pot sticker with maybe a braised tomato confit of sort, possibly. This looks like caviar. Gross. Some sort of salad upon maybe a cheese or rubber sourdough. Chomps is chomping on. Okay, <laughs> keep it down over there. Okay, and then there is London fish and chips. Sausage, beans, and fruits, chips. Basically, your Thanksgiving problems solved. We've got genuinely juicy turkey gravy for procrastinated pigs, pies without the fuss, and so much more. Well, if you celebrate Thanksgiving, and if you celebrate it like me, I don't celebrate it for what they want us to celebrate it for because that's wrong if you know anything about American history. Thanksgiving's pretty much the cry and run shame. I'm actually thanks for the things in our life. Thankfulness. Not taking land and killing innocent people. Okay, yeah, I won't get into it. <clears throat> so here's some restaurant people. More chefs. And there's some more advertisements. Oh, but look at this. That's cool right here. Okay, we're gonna just get the dry swift. And we're just gonna drive this road all the way around here. this villa and we are going to have the most delicious meal cooked and prepared for us from our meals and the beautiful music and the sunset okay let's, let's go <laughs> okay so this is best new This is going to show you all the new restaurants. Story of Baba's Pantry. And this is a Extremador Almond Pie. Look at that caramelization. Look at that. You want to have a dark golden crust. Gives you flavor. It gives you flaky. Too light. I have a soggy bottom. Nobody wants that. Oh my pie. There he is. This is Cafe Mutton. Oh, enjoy. Creamy crab horsing on it. Crispy crepes with dark maple syrup. 
anytime orange muffins. Someone, oh, she drew from the Costco's cranberry and orange muffins. So uh, two sticks of butter, two and a three, two and a third cups all-purpose flour, two teaspoon baking powder, one teaspoon one tablespoon finely grated herb zest, one and three quarters cups sugar plus more for sprinkling, two large eggs, one and three teaspoon vanilla, third cup of fresh orange juice, and a cup of half and half. It looks like a steadfast recipe, and if you could substitute sour cream instead of the steadfast, it would be better. We'll see. Fish with rum butter. This is the kalalu. This is the pork pepper pot. And then this is the coconut trisleches. And there's the recipe. love letter to the island of Sicily. My grilled chicken, fennel, and celery granulata. This one is in Portland, Oregon. Not too far away. The story of Corn begins in the land known as Mexico, long before Spanish colonizers arrived. The tasting menu goes deep with six courses of seriously delicious Mexican history. What is this place called? Republica. So we've got Ancestral potato chipotle queso, agua dulce, agua chili will wild. Oh my god, that's tongue twisters right now. I am, I need more coffee, not my tea. <laughs> Sugar snap peas, local cucumber apples, popo, arbo, pepitas, squid wings, pea, gross. Oh, sorry. This is an Indian restaurant. Chantilly cream, sweet potato and bowl of cheese dough, baked fruity bites with Jezebel sauce. And now I'm gonna have a drink of my tea. Sunday roast. Mm -hmm. 
Y le hacemos así. Eso nos es quedó bien bien. Buttermilk biscuits with curry gravy. That's a good one. Old bean yajang boiled rice. Congee pot pie. Some congee. One batter to rule them all. I don't like beer batter. All purpose fry batter. So I think that's good to keep on hand. I think this is like a light batter, like a tempura batter, basically. That's what it reminds me of. But. Well, it's fun to. Try herbs too, I thought. Guy Fieri's dream dinner party. And here's the advertisement for some sauce and a credit card. And that's it. That is your magazine. And I hope that it was relaxing. Sorry, my energy level is just rather low. <clears throat> I've just been kind of tired lately, extra tired. So I will do a makeup and a hair video soon. And I'm just sad that I don't have nails. It's my own fault. So, anyway, forgive me, my dear friends, for my lack of nails. But anyway, all right, go make something yummy and eat it. Okay, I'm giving you a hug and saying toodly doodah, goodbye. Bon appétit.